गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई एम हेयर विथ अ न्यू चैप्टर बिफोर यू स्क्वायर एंड स्क्वायर रूट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू डिफाइन स्क्वायर इफ एम बी ए नेचुरल नंबर एंड दिस नेचुरल नंबर कैन बी एक्सप्रेस एज एन स्क्वायर वेयर एन इज ऑल्सो ए नेचुरल नंबर देन एम इज सेट टू बी ए स्क्वायर नंबर इफ ए नेचुरल नंबर एम can be expressed expressed as n square where n is also a natural number then m is a square number for example we take 16 16 can be expressed as 4 square a natural number 16 can be expressed as 4 square and 4 is also a natural number it means 16 is a square number in the other way 9 can be expressed as 3 square 9 is a natural number and 3 is also a natural number so 9 is a square number. now we see some pattern and through this pattern we learn some properties of natural number These are the squares of first ten natural numbers, and through this pattern, we shall observe some properties of a square number. So, dear students, what we have observed first? First of all, we see that here. these are odd numbers these are odd numbers and what we observe we observe that a square of an odd number is also an odd number here we see a square of 1 is 1 1 is also odd number a square of 3 9 this is Odd number is square of five twenty five. Both this is also odd number. So we have the first property: a square of an odd number is also an odd number. In the same way, when we see a square of two, a square of four, a square of six, a square of eight, a square of ten, we see that a square of an even number is also an even number. Here, what we observe, 
We have the that the square of 2 is 4, 4 is an even number, a square of 4 is 16, 16 is an even number, a square of 6 is 36, 36 is an even number, a square of 8 is 64, this is also an even number, and a square of 10 is 100, this is also an even number. So we observe that a square of an even number is also an even, while a square of an odd number is also an odd. Now, we see another property. These are the squares of first 10 natural numbers. And we see the squares are 1, 4, 9, 6, 5, 6, 9, 4, 1, 0. So, if we check the last digit of the square, we see that these are 1, 4, Six, one, four, six, nine, and zero. One, four, five, also five, also four, five, six, nine. 0. So, we see that the last digit of a square number must be either this 6 number. Last digit. Must be end with this. Any square number must be end with this 6 digits. Any one of the 6 digits. So, the rest digit 2, 3, 7, 8. So we see that a number end with the digit either 2, 3, 7, and 8. Such type of number is not an square number. If a number end with the digit 2, 3, 7 and 8, then these numbers are not a square number. Clear? Is it clear? So, this is the random checking of a square. Now, we see another property of a square. One plus three. This is equal to four, and four is equal to two square. One plus three plus five. This is equal to nine, and nine is can be expressed as three square. One plus three plus five plus 7 plus 9. This is equal to 16. And 16 is equal to 4 square. So, here we observe a very important property that is the square of any number is equal to the sum of an odd number that is that means if you have to find the square of 5 you can find it by adding first 5 odd number 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 and the sum of this first 5 odd number is 25 so a square is a square of 5 is 25 so it gives a method of getting a square root. How? This method is known as repeat subtraction method. How it can verify repeat subtraction method? If you have to find the square root of 25 by repeat subtraction method, you can find easily 
A square root of 25 you have to find by repeat subtraction method. First of all, in a step first, we subtract first odd number. This is 124. Then step 2, we subtract second odd number. 24 minus 3. That is 21. Now, third step, 21 minus 5, this is 6 step. Fourth step, 21 minus se uh, 16 minus 7, this is 9. And fifth step, 9 minus 9. And this pro process will continue till The remainder is 0 and uh, we count how many steps, so there are 5 steps, so a square root of 25 is equal to 5. So dear students, we have learnt here some properties of a square and a square number. I hope this will be beneficial for you. Thank you. Thank you very much.